The Ralwana United Church was filled with dignitaries, families and community members who paid tribute to the great man's life and legacy through gospel songs in the beautiful Kwanwa language. The service concluded with a casket of Sir Rabbi Namalyu being transported to Tokwa Airport before heading to Port Moresby to be laid to rest at the Independence Hill on the 18th of April 2023. The call to worship was led by Reverend August Waninara, while family representative Jack Namalyu delivered a moving eulogy. Church elder of RUC Alan Piddick, senior statesman Leo Dion, Raluana LLG President Tio Lamawaga, member for Kokopo Airman Tobani Jr., Rabbi Namali Jr., and Deputy Prime Minister John Rosso also paid tribute to Sir Rabbi Langanai Namali. We're all here today to take a big uh, thank you to this beautiful province we get to call home. Um, it's been a hard journey. It's been a hard journey. Yeah. We plan my walkabout, but it's my last my walkabout, one of the more dignitaries, blah, blah, blah. Big plus something, blah, like talk. Um, there's not enough thank yous in the world that this province has done for our family. We are beneficiaries in every sense of the word. Our dad got to, he came from this province, as you heard from my Uncle Jack. He came from this province. This province gave, gave him so much opportunity, and then he rose to the top. So our family is forever indebted to this beautiful province. May I also give condolences to the family, our people of Ralawana, on behalf of the rest of Papua New Guinea on behalf of the Pangu Party, and on behalf of all citizens of Papua New Guinea. Mipla to thank you, Loyupla. Loyupla Karim Wampla, good pla, pikini nina, give Mipla, na halbim, put in Mipla lo where now you miss up as a country, as an independent country. Without these great men and these great women, we would not be where we are today. The funeral service ended with final farewells from people of Sir Rabi's hometown. Despite the delay from Tokwa Airport, the casket of Sir Rabbi Langane Namalyu was eventually boarded and transported to Port Moresby, where an official welcome awaited its arrival, led by Minister for Foreign Affairs Justin Kichenko and ministerial delegates. Minister Kichenko welcomed the funeral party from Rabal and presided over a prayer ceremony before the casket returned to Erma Funeral Home. Sir Rabbi Langane Namali's contributions to the nation will always be remembered and his final journey was a fitting tribute for a great leader. And I thank the Namayu family and all the relatives from East New Britain and especially all his people from Kokopo. On Sunday 16th, April 2023, a national house cry will be held for the great leader at the Sir John Guy Stadium. Tentative time is from 5 p.m. till 9.30 p.m. This will be followed by Lane State at the Grand Hall at the Parliament House on Monday 17th, April and official funeral service and burial program to be held on Tuesday 18th, April 2023. Kao Kido Jr., TV1 News.